Today I'm going to be playing a game, but to play the game I'm going to need a friend. Hello, my name is Dina and I have drawn a drawing and I'm going to try and explain it and describe it to Rin. And then I am going to have to draw it without being able to see it. And I can't see what she has already drawn. And I can't see what Rin is drawing at all. So, so we're, we're going both blind. completely blind. <laughs> we have no idea what the other one's doing. And this is going to be so much fun. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be a mess, but it's going to be a hot mess. It's going to be a fun mess. Yeah, so let's do it. Let's do it. And since it is the month of May, we've both decided to draw mermaids and describe them to each other. Well, I've drawn a merman. Ooh. <laughs> so <laughs> I thought I would challenge you a tiny bit. So we're going to start with the head. So it's kind of like a three quarter view and it's quite a big circle. Okay. Uh, but three quarter view. Is it looking left or right? Uh, looking towards the left of the page. Okay. And is this near the top of the page? Yes. So the head is quite. Leave a little bit of room at the top because you're gonna give okay. him a kind of fin going in a curve towards the other oh, side. Boy, this is from all. The top right. <laughs> <laughs> no. I just realized oh, how far this is gonna be. Um. Okay. Wait. It's a. It's a man. Yeah, but he has a shark head. A shark head? Yeah. What? <laughs> so like a big nose? Like a big bulbulous so nose So it kind of goes, yeah. So you have a three-quarter head, and he's looking to to the left, but a little bit down. And oh, a little bit down. A little bit that down. That was important. Yeah, that was important. <laughs> <laughs> I think me and my eraser are going to get very friendly today. A <laughs> little bit down. A little bit down. Well, his neck is really short, so where the end of the snout is mm -hmm. is kind of like where his collarbone is so it's kind of looking what <laughs> <laughs> i just realized how hard this is going to be to explain <laughs> to the, it's just the same le like uh, level. level so if you go like to the right a little bit you kind of make a circle for his chest so you kind of like a little bit to the side but his <laughs> Chin Golly. goes all the way down to the collarbone in a way, and his, his neck is like really big on the side. This is going real well. I'm very confident. Yeah. I'm just excited to see what you can do with the same idea, but not see what I'm doing. This looks a little bit like a gargoyle right now. Ooh, that's good. That's good? Yeah. I'm starting very simple so that I can erase it. Yes, okay. good idea. Okay, so. His shoulder and arm is kind of going backwards. Like if we were gonna sprint somewhere, you kind of okay, yeah, have I your arm back it. like that. And his hand is kind of in that position as well. Yeah. <laughs> and kind of claw-like, but he's kind of leaning forward and that's what I tried to like talk, like say when he was, his head is kind of going uh -huh. down a little bit. So it's a little bit hunched forward. Um, uh -huh. Yeah. And then his older shoulder is kind of hidden a little bit behind his head because you like seeing him leaning forward. Okay, so, so right shoulders behind him or left shoulders behind him? Left side mm -hmm. out of the page, uh, his shoulder is behind him. Oh, behind his head. Oh, shoot. I did the opposite. Okay, so he's, he's facing <laughs> towards the left side. Yeah, your he's left. facing the left. Yeah. And his chest is also facing left, so the his right shoulder... Oh, I made the chest facing the right! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> we Shoot. switched it around. How do I fix this? Uh, I thought it was going so well. Eraser, eraser, eraser. It would actually be cool the other way, actually. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I like the, the no. angles. <laughs> okay, so the shoulder on the left is behind him. Yes. So I just need to like flip this around. That would have been funny if we never cleared that up. <laughs> <laughs> we should have just left him. it. <laughs> So the left one, you don't see his arm at all, you only see his shoulder, or...? Uh, left side of the page is behind his head, and well, his shoulder is behind the head, so his... And that arm is going up a little bit, like he's holding something up to his face, but he's holding a spear. Close to his face? Eh, yeah, sort of close. Like, a 90 degree <laughs> angle in his elbow-ish. So he's going up a bit. I was more confident when I had it the other way. <laughs> no! <laughs> Should've this just it. looks like scribbles now. <laughs> so where's the elbow? Can you see the elbow? Uh, yes, you can see the elbow. So and it's he's, above he... his head, or level with his head. Uh, the elbow is just the level of its hips. We haven't drawn his hips yet. His hand is the level of his head, so he's holding his hand oh. up. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Did that make it a little bit better? I can't get it down to his hips because they made his chest too big, but. <laughs> 
Well, it doesn't. You can still go like out a little bit. It's not too like his hand is not too close to his face. It's There's like, also no room for the spear on the. Uh, eh, it's not that important. The character is what's important here. Give him some. Is he muscly? Yes, very muscly. Okay. But his Good head is quite eye. big. Like his head is on the size of his chest, and then like his legs are quite small <laughs> compared to it. <laughs> I'm gonna have to look up. Okay, that looks like a pterodactyl. I'm gonna Just, have to look. Do you say he has a fin on his head? Uh, yes, it's going towards the right side of the page. Perfect. Kind of like a nice swoop. Like a shark fin. And he has a little nook in it if you want to add that, and a little, uh, like ring. Where's the ring? At the end? Um, at, or lower yeah, to the bo- base? Lower, lower to the base, uh, on the back, in a way. Does that make sense? Mm-hmm. So it's like one of those things scientists do clip. <laughs> I don't... Yeah, yeah. Didn't know they did that. <laughs> uh, like a fish for... hook kind of thing. I don't know oh. something metal, something metal like. It's a fish hook. All right. I think we're getting somewhere. What about the legs? <laughs> uh, so his torso is going quite just like not completely straight down, but a little way towards the right side of the page. But right. it's kind of like we're looking down a little bit. Just not too much, not like really uh-huh. distorted, but just a little bit. And then his, the 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 leg who that's on the left side of the page, which is the right, the same. Wait, his two legs? Yes. What? <laughs> He's still a mermaid. Oh man, okay, okay, okay. I don't know. Okay, wait, wait, wait. It's just the wrong way around. I just like drawing mermen like this, so it's kind of my <laughs> style. <laughs> wait a minute, does he not have shoulders? Oh, he does have shoulders. Okay. Because now I'm picturing, like, fish on the top. Ah, uh, no, no, no. He has shoulders. He's okay. not He's not just a fish at the top. And like, it would just be, like, a triangle <laughs> <laughs> with eyes. Uh, no. Ah. Please have shoulders. <laughs> so his right leg is the same as his right arm, which is the one that's on the left side of the page. And it's kind of bent. Yeah, his knee's high, a little bit higher up. It's not, like, a hip level, but it's just, think, like, halfway... Not halfway, but be- halfway between like having it at hip level and having it straight down. So it's like mid thigh. Yeah. Can you see the whole leg, or is it like mostly knee? Uh, you can see the whole leg, but his foot is like really elongated, like a fin, like a swimming foot, like a flipper. Okay, I gotta make room for that. I'm running out of room on the page. Here. <laughs> Let me see. And he's like. Heel is turned up like he's stepping into something. So his what? foot is going up a little bit. So he's kind of like. So he's like stepping. Well, he's not. He's in water. But if you were yeah, treading with like, like flippers, yeah, you would. You would like. You would What's the up. other leg doing then? Uh, it's going backwards a little bit, but it's going a like that. The the knee is going straight down from the hip, and then mm-hmm. going backwards into towards the right side of the page, so like the corner. Mm-hmm. Oh, and he has a little tail as well. Oh, where do I put that? <laughs> <laughs> it's like a shark fin, like a stumpy shark fin at the end of his butt. It's stumpy? I'm having a hard time with the legs. You said the legs look small. I think my thighs are too big. You yeah, they look. I just made them small because they had to fit on the page. <laughs> <laughs> That's the problem I'm having. I'm so excited to see this. Uh, yeah, you are. <laughs> <laughs> just like, I feel like the trick is to listen to what I'm saying, but also make it look good yourself and not like ignoring parts of what I'm saying. Mm. So is the arm on the right side of the page coming down on the paper? Uh, it's going upwards a little bit. So he's he's looking to the left side of the page, but his mm-hmm. the, the arm on the right side of the page is going upwards in kind of... What, what did we say earlier? I think you got it earlier. Yeah, but it's going, like, his elbow is going up and back. <laughs> I drew the left elbow pretty high, so this looks real bad. <laughs> let me see, let me pull his Try chest. and ignore some of the things I say. Just, like, <laughs> do Which it. ones? <laughs> Whatever you need to ignore, I don't know. So does it look like he's running through water? Yeah, yeah. Okay, I probably should have just started there. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. That could have been the easy way to explain it. I've never drawn a shark, except for blub shark. <laughs> I was just blub sh- a shark, and then I remember what a blub shark is. Well, no, a blub shark? Blub fish. Am I confused? Well, yes, I'm very confused. There's a, there's a fish called the blob fish. Yeah. Then I have a character called blub fish, so it's with a U. 
Okay. The letter U. And that is a fish that I draw all the time. Like, I started drawing them years ago. Wait. So anytime I draw a mermaid, I draw a blubfish. And one time I drew a blub shark and I sold them as stickers. Aww. <laughs> what are the eyes? Are the eyes on the side of his head or does he have like a man face? Uh, it's on the side of his face. Uh, okay. so you only That's see one doing. eye. Yeah, you only see one Ooh, eye. You only see one eye. Yeah. Because he's kind of turned a little bit three quarter and his like, the bridge of his nose snout thing is too mm-hmm. high to see the other eye, so it doesn't... Okay, yeah, I get it. And, oh, his eyes are like, half closed. So it's kind of like... S- and then he's smirking, like an evil grin with lots of teeth. Oh, dear. I don't have no room for teeth. Wait a minute. <laughs> I'm this so excited. <laughs> I want to see. Is, uh, this looks like a blobfish's uncle right now. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it is. I have a feeling yours is like attractive in some way. Um. Yeah. Kind of. Maybe. Oh dear. <laughs> I might look up a reference of a shark after I get this hand working. Yeah. Do that. That's what I had to do for his face because I wasn't sure how to draw the shark face until I looked it up. Although I see all the white space there, which is like, oh, that's probably where it's supposed to be, but it just doesn't work anatomically. Mm. Cause he's, yeah, he's kind of hunched forward. I, don't, I, was, I explained it in the beginning, but I think it was just Yeah, I had to erase arm. it all when I yeah. did it. And I don't remember how I explained it. Like, yeah, no, if... If a sprinter is leaning forward and having one mm-hmm. hand on the on the flo- on the ground, but the other one up and not touching anything, that's the same pose as the arm on the right side of the page. Where's the elbow on the, the right side of the page? Elbow on the right sp- uh, side of the page is shoulder at the top, shoulder. then elbow, top. kind of a little bit lower than the shoulder, and then oh, the hand okay. going down I heard that in a wrong. claw. Okay, that's what I've been doing because I was like, I can't do it the way I thought you were describing. Did it help? Yeah, what you're describing is what I decided to do to fix what I thought you were describing. Ah. Oh, his gills is on the side of his uh, chest, by the way. So his ribcage is like gills, like three gills going down. Ooh, fun. I know. Oh, and he has like a seaweed hula hoop skirt. Not hula hoop, hula, <laughs> hula, hula dancing skirt. skirt. Not like a lot of seaweed in a way like it's like strips of it here and there and it's going yeah. not not any further than his leg like it's just above his knees yeah and they kind of go uh, you just make them like pretty going whatever like so it doesn't hide his legs because i didn't okay. want to do that either <laughs> but it hides the important parts to hide and he also has like a little piece of fishnet on the right well his right well his left hip It'll be. Actually, I probably should figure out the legs first. Oh, yeah. Do, <laughs> They're do still kind of scribbles. I'm kind of just throwing things out there just in case. <laughs> yeah, that's helpful. <laughs> good, 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 good. We're doing one color, right? Because I kind of added two. I ended up not putting any color in mine, <gasps> but... Uh, I might want to add that because I like color. Let me know when you figured out the legs because the feet <laughs> are interesting. You said they're really long though, right? Yeah, like flippers. And they're a little bit sharp, like a shark tail would be, but just like one right. thin. Let me pull this leg in a bit. But you know how bats kind of have different, like, fingers sticking out? It's kind of like mm-hmm. his big toe is shorter than the next toe, but the next toe is super long and connected by the fin that goes Ooh, to his That's kind of how I was drawing it. <gasps> Yay! I was hoping that. I, I, I thought it was kind of like a natural way of doing it. Shoot. In my head, I could see this leg being really cool, but I can't seem to get it right. <laughs> you can do it! Ooh, here we go. That's what I wanted. Hmm, I can't decide if that's better. But it looks like he's swimming now, so... Yeah, that's good. We'll yeah, yeah. stick with that. Like, the f- actual foot section of the flipper, like, not including toes. What percentage of the flipper? Uh, the whole thing. So, so the toes don't stick out past the foot? Or? So the toes are like elongated to kind of be like a bat wing, but not a bat wing, just a feet version of a bat. And so that the fin part goes all the way to the heel. <laughs> <laughs> You've got me bewildered. <laughs> I don't want to bend this flipper. Oh, he has like fin things on his... um elbows as well they stick out they just make the the elbows kind of look lo- long and sharp okay so that, that should I can be do. too clean. Yeah. all right i need to do that skirt how high up on his belly does it go mm, it's right above his hips 
So, right where his belly button is, I think. But you still see all three gills going down his side. He has no nipples, this is important. Oh. <laughs> no, did, you <laughs> did you hear the erasing? Two pecs. Yeah. So weird, just sitting here blind. I can't see anything. <laughs> I want to watch you draw. <laughs> This doesn't really look like seaweed. It looks like french fries. <laughs> oh, mine kind of looks like jagged long leaves. Um, like the top of the skirt is tied with the fishnet, but it doesn't look like a fishnet at that point, but it just hangs down on the left side of his hip. Does that make sense? I think I'm probably... It's gonna have to make sense. <laughs> um, yeah, I... That I'm just guessing. And so there's like, the top of the skirt is rope, or... Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm just being quiet so you can cut it out of the video if you want. <laughs> Is there any texture to the seaweed? Uh, yeah, I, you know those bubble things that you get on texture, like on seaweed sometimes? They can pop? No. No? <laughs> what? I don't know. What? Have you never picked up seaweed and it has those bubbles and you can pop them like bubble wrap? No. No? <laughs> it's just a few of those. It's just a few, like... What? Like bubble wrap. Yeah, two, three on each, like, leaf thing. Oh, that actually it looks like cheese. <laughs> You're pretty, I guess. Dude, that looks kind of cool. It just gives it a little bit extra, like, detail. It looks like he made a skirt out of Spongebob. <laughs> <laughs> That's horrible. All right, back to the feet. Okay. So I, I, I've, I've been thinking about how to explain this better. Mm -hmm. So, if you think of the foot as the hand, in a way, mm -hmm. but it only has two fingers, in a way. In a way, like, it does have more fingers, but it's, like, weirdly shaped, so the longest one is, like, the one that's where the thumb would be, and then the mm -hmm. next one is longer than that, and that one has the fin part connecting from the tip of the toe where the claw is, and all the way down to the heel. To the heel. Yeah. So, it's so like, like the like toe shark. comes out of the heel, is that what you're saying? Yeah, pretty much. Well, it's... <laughs> I wish I could show you. <laughs> is it like a frog? Yes! Yes! Oh, okay. You oh, that's... <laughs> 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 you just said that. <laughs> oh, I made it so difficult. It has like a sharp nail claw thing. This is coming together. Yay! Ah, oh, it was such a mess in the beginning. I'm so happy. <laughs> it's like a, it's like a, it's like a brief. I'm telling you what I see in my head, and you have to make it look cool. A reality. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Make my imagination a reality, please. Okay. Oh, we have to do the arm on the right side of the page. Mm. Said so it's like claw-like. Yeah, at the bottom. Like his hand is a claw like claw like. But as I said, like if somebody was like in a running Naruto pose in a way, but the arm is kind of bent, but not in a, instead of straight. Ooh. And then the arm on the left side of the page. Yeah. What's that one doing? It's kind of if he's holding something up, but it's holding the spear up. Straight up and down? Uh a little bit on an angle towards like if the spear was pointing a little bit towards the left side of the page, so like the top left. And is the... is it pointy at the bottom? Uh, it's actually not, but it's like quite skinny. It's very pointy at the top. The top? Mm. Like the the sharp... Uh, the pointy end is at the top. <laughs> I think I want to go in with pencil now. Okay. Finalize what my idea is, so I guess I can't ask any more questions. I don't know. Let me see. Um, do you have his face right? Probably not. Is he- is it- it's really pointy? Uh, yeah, shark. it's like a shark face. Stylized shark face. So the nose is kind of like, snout-like, pointing out. Where the heck does the nose on a shark go? God, they're so scary. <laughs> uh, my first- the first face that I drew was very much inspired by the movie Shark Tale. <laughs> With Will Smith. Oh, wait, that actually might be a very good <laughs> Jack reference. Black is the shark. Um, that might be what I had in mind when I was... Ah, oh, really? Uh, then not... I want to soften up his pointy... his nose then. Well, <laughs> uh, yeah, it's 
similar. I just realized how creepy these characters are from the movie. <laughs> I remember yeah. watching them and loving it. Yeah, I watched that movie a lot. I guess it's kind of similar, but this guy is a little bit more fit. <laughs> and it doesn't- he has like legs. You said he had a big neck, right? Yeah. He actually looks kind of cool. <gasps> Yay! Uh, in a weird yeah. kind of way. You know, I tried. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure he's awesome. I'm so excited. So, oh, the spear. Yeah. There's so much pencil. The tip of the over. spear oh. is like jaggedy. I think I'm done with the sketch. <gasps> is there any bubbles? Um, I just, yeah, I just added a f few floating bubbles above his heads, but they're not really that important. But you can add them if you want. I want to add some bubbles. <laughs> <laughs> you just want to add some bubbles. Doesn't matter if I said this. Do oh. you want to add in a slight pattern, like a shark pattern? Uh, I was just like doing that as I went, like the dark on the top of the head. Yeah, actually. yeah, pretty much. Yeah, it's very, very normal. But you can add that if you want. Does it come out from like the side of his torso too? Yes, <laughs> but um, the sides yeah. where the gills are is like gray blue. And I added some like stripes on his forearms and like uh, arms, but um, it's not that important. It's just for me. <laughs> it was fun to do. <laughs> Is he like angry? <laughs> yeah, a little bit. Like he's uh, he's grinning, but he's also kind of frowning. So evil grin frown thing. Yeah, I took a picture of mine as well, so I'm ready to show it. Oh boy. Oh boy. I think I used the 8B pencil for the line art. Ooh la la. <laughs> Did you add his scar, by the way? Where's the scar? Over across his eye. It doesn't okay. doesn't make him blind or anything. It's just across his eye, like. Gotcha. The pencil was a good idea. Cool. The spear is still... Questionable. Confusing. Ready to get your mind blown? Yes. <laughs> Please. <laughs> that helped it look a little bit more like seaweed. And not Spongebob. Alrighty. Alright, I think I'm ready to show you. <gasps> Let me take a picture. <gasps> do, 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 do. <gasps> oh, it's so cool! Oh, he's so cool! Now show me what yours is. Oh my god, he's so cool! Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna share mine, but that's cool! Really? Yeah! <laughs> what? It's like different from mine. I'm sending it now. Oh my gosh! <laughs> well, I actually. We just looked this. They look like a good job explaining. It's similar. Like, they are like cousins, they're related. <laughs> I, I messed up it. the feet. <laughs> no, but they work the same way. It's super cool. But Wait, how yeah. did we? How did I put the net on the wrong side? I don't know. That's okay. I think it's that... so crazy seeing like the same drawing in two different art styles. It's so cool. I love it. And it worked really well with the purple as well because it looks like you colored it, but you did really. It's so, yeah. so cool. <laughs> Yay! It worked. That's so that was like really fun. Yeah, stressful. it was really stressful at the beginning, but once yeah. you like let yourself. Okay, I I know how to draw. Let yeah. me just take the idea and you know run with it. Turn it into something that makes sense to me. Yeah, which I guess is the job of an artist when someone asks them to draw something anyway. Yeah, it is. You you have to kind of. They never know exactly what they want or what they see in their heads, so you kind of just have to take it and make the best of it. Yeah, well, thank you for uh, doing this collab with me. You're welcome. It's so fun. <laughs> We're going to go do the same thing over on her channel. On oh, my channel. <laughs> so I'll have a link in the description. And I drew a little mystery something. Ooh, I'll blur that out. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm going to describe it to her and have her draw it. And we'll see what it looks like. So, yeah, let's all hop over there. <laughs> yeah, thank you guys for watching. Have a delicious evening full of waffles. <laughs> Bye! Bye. <laughs>